Let's go for the intro. Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black with the purple strip. Yeah, so um, yeah, yeah. As you see above my head, the score. It was uh, one of those games. It was one of those games. Um, man. Might be a time to say this could be my dues last year. Could be my dues last year. MP Juice, man. I'm just elephant in the room. I believe he gave up two TDs. Um, that last one, it ain't no excuse. He gave that up. He gave it up. Um, yeah, there's no excuse. Defense, other than. MP Juice Man, I believe they play pretty decent. But if one person on that team is not playing good, it can make the whole defense collapse. And that right there is to me is MP Juice Man. Yeah, Marcus Peters. Yeah. Man. Um I'm like a lost of words right now, for real. Like, dude. Don't get me wrong, Jacksonville's decent. They're decent. But people talking about we gonna win the Super Bowl and all that type of stuff. With this offense, I don't see it happening. I do see what's happening is um it's like the <clears throat> it's like the fam um <coughs> Ravens un, un, un gatekeepers with Fam Hendo says Ravens will draft the cornerback next year first round and is coming in intuition. I think that's how you say it. I see it. I see it happening. Uh, Marcus Peters gone. In comes the rookie. Oh, um, that's that's what I see happening now. But yeah, let's uh let's get to uh yeah depressing. I don't. Uh, or just going before we even get to the stats. Let me give you my my thoughts right off the back before I even get to the stats. Okay, first. And I'm sorry, we I'm looking off, y'all. I'm I'm doing something as well before I get to that. But okay, first we the offense, the defense was playing great. Then the offense decided we are about to do what we do and play trash. And I've on so many occasions. I think y'all already know where I'm gonna go with this. Patrick freaking record. <laughs> I think it was like a second and what was that? Second and fourteen, something like that. Screen pass to him. He catches it, gets like four yards, let's say. Third down is third and ten. And I know the play wasn't designed to go to him, but why was he out there running a route that a wide receiver should run? And Lamar had to pass it to him because nobody else was open. And 
The office is trash. My boy, Marcus Peters, play like trash. I've been trying not to show it. Like the first TD, I was like, well, Chuck was in the area. He was on both of them. But then, freaking Lawrence, Lance, Taylor, whatever quarterback for the Jaguars was like, well, if you don't believe that, let me show you. I'm going to that man. To get a first down, I'm going to Marcus Peters. To get a touchdown, I'm going to Marcus Peters. Ah. Oh. And the Ravens don't need no cornerback in the first round. We need a wide receiver. The only way we do not get a wide receiver in the first round is if we literally sign one that is proven, that is young. But yes, but yes, my dude is the weakness of the group. The injury he had last year, I think he said that was his first serious injury throughout his NFL career, and he's lost a step, and that's a big step he's lost. He's not playing like bad, bad, bad. Like last year, why a cornerback is bad, but... Yeah, he's lost a step, and they picking on him. They are picking on him. Either we need to try to send some more help to his side or something, but I don't know, but they're picking on him. But, um, yeah, that's, um, uh, okay. <sighs> I had to get that off, y'all. I had to get that off. Let's, let's talk, let's look at a little bit of stats. Let's get a little bit of stats. <sighs> Lamar Jackson, 1632. 254 yards and one TD. Um, he got sacked one time. He overthrew some passes, yes, but you know, the drops, we're gonna we let, let's just get to let's get to that later. Rushing. 14 carries, Lamar, 89 yards. Gus, 16 carries, 52 yards, one TD. Gus had that fumble, which contribute to the L we received today. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm just not seeing, looking at this y'all right here. I don't know if you can see my mouse. Right there, that fourth quarter. 15, 18. Mm, mm. Too many, too many points. We should okay. That that's 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 it for rushing. I man, Josh Oliver was the best tight end to play today for the Ravens. And I'm not just talking about yards. I'm talking about overall. He was the best tight end to play for the Ravens today. Receptions four receptions. 76 yards and one TD. Longest one was 40 yards. Dang, that didn't seem like a 40 yarder. D Jack, two receptions, 74 yards, 62. Now, three targets. Now, with D Jack on that bomb he caught, that was a that was a Hollywood Brown play. That was a Hollywood Brown play. And it's really showing that my dude, Eric DeCosta, he really should have drafted some speed. He should have drafted this on speed. Devin DuVernay, I know he's supposed to be that speedster. He's not a speedster. In my opinion, he's not a speedster. Um, he, he's not that Hollywood speed. He's not that even D-Jack speed. He's not that. He's too bulky. But, yeah, so he's not as elusive. That's what I'm looking for. He's not as elusive as a D-Jack and the Hollywood is. But Mark Andrews, he dropped what? Two of them this this game, I believe. Maybe even more. He dropped a touchdown. Uh D Rob, they D Rob, he uh, did he drop one too? I know Lamar overthrew him a couple of times, I believe. Pat Ricard, two receptions. 
14 too. Uh, but um, Drake dropped. I don't even remember seeing a pass to Gus. I'm gonna be real. Prochet actually had a catch. Great catch too. But they took that back with a holding penalty. I know Lamar had that kind of fumble going on the fourth and the one. I don't really trip on that because he didn't get the the first down anyway, and they literally just stayed in the same spot. So I know some people are gonna be trying to trip off that. N nothing to me. But yeah, um, Mark Andrews. He oh he did fumble. He like what two drops and a fumble. Defense. Marcus Peters let he got eight tackles, but they was picking on him the whole game. That ain't even you know. But Quan awesome. PQ he missed some tackles. He missed some tackles. Chuck Clark. I don't know. Brandon Stevens played good. Chuck Clark, I don't know. Marlon Humphrey played good. Bro, when Washington played good. Geno, he missed some tackles. Class Campbell, Bowser, Matabuki played good. But yeah, this game was just. Man. Justin Tucker, excellent. Excellent. No one should be trying to come at Justin Tucker for missing. What was that, a 67-yarder? They said he would have hit it if it was a 65. But, yeah, so. Man. Depressing. But look, be on the lookout for that um highlight. It's going to be pain editing that, y'all. Every time a Ravens lose the game and I have to rewatch it to do edit, oh gosh. Man. But Mark Andrews, you get a one star out of five. MP, you get a half a star out of five. No, I take that back. Mark Andrews, you get a half a star out of five. MP, you get a Marcus Peters, you get a half a star out of five. Lamar, I'm going to give you a four star because you making stuff happen with your running and everything, even though I don't want you to run. Gus, your game back, I'm going to give you a did not participate. Even though you, you made that fun, I'm going to give you a did not, did not participate because you all, we got to get you back in game, game mode. Josh Oliver, you get a five star. D Jack, I'm even give you, I'm gonna give you a four star D Jack. Laquan Smith, five star. Humphrey, five star. Bowser, Matabuki, the whole defensive front line is Seb Owe. So I will say Matabuki, Campbell, um, Washington, Bowser. Y'all got five stars in my book. Because y'all did. You did what you had to do. I'll give you a four star. I'll take that, take that back. I'll give you a four star. But yeah, so. Thank you all for watching. We caught the L. We caught the L. Everybody stay safe. God bless.